I am lucky to have a boyfriend like Eric Bennett. He's such a gentleman, always taking care of me. Jenny, my dear. It's time for our visitors to arrive. Of course, how silly of me. Your brother, sister-in-law and niece are coming to see us? That's correct, and they are looking forward to meeting you. Knock knock. We have arrived. Welcome to our home, bro and company. Thanks, Eric and... Who's this? Hello, Eric's family. My name is Jenny Gray, and I'm Eric's girlfriend. Hello, Jenny. I'm Steve, Eric's brother. I'm Julie, Eric's sister-in-law. And the little one? Does she have a name? Marcia, Whitney's. She's our daughter. It's lovely to meet you all, and your daughter is so sweet. How old is she? Seven months. We are very pleased to meet you, Jenny. Would you like to hold the baby, Jenny? I'd love to. Oh, Marcia, you are so cuddly. Aunt Jenny loves you. Aunt Jenny? That's right, Marcia. From now on, you will address her as Aunt Jenny. Bless your little heart, Marcia. Isn't she cute? She's very cute. So, Jenny, tell us a little about yourself. What's your background? Well, I was born in 1945 into a big family and I'm the youngest of the 15 children my parents had. In 1963, I graduated high school and went on to study fashion at Illinois State University until 1966. After graduating college, my degree in hand, I started my own fashion label which makes a wide range of clothing, including baby clothes. 14 brothers and sisters? That's crazy! I have eight older brothers and six older sisters, all born between 1922 and 1943. My sister Jocelyn is the first born. Born in 1922, she fought in World War II between ages 18 and 23, alongside my parents, who are now well into their 90s. So, do any of your older siblings have families of their own? Oh yeah. All of them do. My brother Dave who came two years before me got married in 1962. I was his maid of honor. He and his wife had a daughter in 1964, and a son in 1967. I will turn 26 in April. My parents are trying to marry me off as soon as possible so they can have more grandchildren. I really do love Eric though. He's the best thing that ever happened to me.